third attempt trying. I had a phone call come in that I had to take, and when we turned the last one off, see when we, and the kids have now said hi to you several times. Ella's not here because she threw a fit when I put her in her chair. She's listening happily to a story in her room. Proverbs 4. Try to keep the phone away from money. <clears throat> Hear, O sons, a father's instructions, and be attentive that you may gain insight. For I give you good precepts, and do not forsake my teaching. When I was a son with my father, tender and the only one in the sight of my mother, he taught me and said to me, Let your heart hold fast my words, keep my commandments, and live. <clears throat> Get, get wisdom, get insight. Do not forget and do not turn away from the words of my mouth. Love her and she will guard you. The beginning of wisdom is God's wisdom. And whatever you get, get insight. Prize her high and she will exalt you. And she will honor you if you embrace her. She will place in your head a graceful garland and she will bestow on you a beautiful crown. Hear my son and accept my words that the years of your life may be many. I have taught you the way of wisdom. I have led you to the path of uprightness. When you walk, your step will not be hampered, and if you run, you will not stumble. He pulled of your instruction, do not let go. Guard her, for she is your life. Do not enter the paths of the wicked, and do not walk in the way of the evil. Avoid it, do not go down it, turn away from it, and pass on. For they cannot sleep who have done wrong. They are robbed of sleep until they have, have made someone stumble. For they eat the bread of wickedness, and they drink the wine of violence. But the path of the righteous is like the light of dawn which shines bright and brighter until full day. Let's turn the page. Hey, Mom. The way of the wicked is like deep darkness. They do not know they do not know over what they stumble. My son, be attentive to my words. Incline your ear to my sayings. Let them not escape from your insight. <clears throat> Keep them within your heart, for they are life to those who find them, and that healing to all their flesh. Keep your heart with all vigilance, for they, for from it flows the springs of life. Put away from you crooked speech, and put your devious talk away from you. Let your eyes look directly forward, and your gaze be straight before you. Ponder the paths of your feet, then all your ways will be sure. Do not swerve to the right or the left. Turn your foot away from evil. All right, that was Proverbs 4. Do you have anything to say, Edward? Um. I have this and um, um, I, Daddy got, Daddy's gonna give me a new school book too, and that's all right, that's all right. and that, I got too. That came today, Edward. What? Your new school book came today. Yussie! Say excuse me. Excuse me. Gwenny, sit up and say goodbye. Goodbye. What? Sit up. <laughs> bye from Winnie. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, say bye. Bye bye. All right, bye everyone. We'll talk with you tomorrow.